Gym leader Babe, the final battle has begun. We face too much to quit now. We've got no choice but to win. He doesn't seem that aggressive anymore. He'll still be aggressive to me. Let me switch over to a Pokemon that can actually take it down. Why don't we just send in the Rock type? Brilliant idea, Matt. Outstanding move. I've been filming for hours. Just humor me. Uh, flame charge. I always seem to forget that Minecraft is incredibly bulky. So bulky, you gotta allocate RAM to get the the good performance. Use too much RAM, it'll make your computer get caught on fire. No gamer wants their computer caught on fire. He's got a Gardevoir. 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 Doesn't its Mega Evolution have really thick thighs? What are Mega Evolutions? What is a soul when it's not broken? To gain a soul, you must break your soul. And lose a bit of special attack. Uh, what are you wishing for, buddy? I bet she was wishing for bigger thighs. It's only in the uh, Mega Evolution timeline, my friend. Rapidash. The My Little Pony version. Okay, derpy hoobs, your ass is mine. Be absorbed into darkness. Oh, that's right, you're, uh, you're part fairy time now. Whoa! Okay, the dream came true. Friendship is magic. Um, yeah, so I have to rethink my strategy. Okay. Um, Dimster, you faint. Faint? No, better idea. Um, Burgermeister. Let's go. So, does a Galarian Darmanitan have a beard or just really big lips? Ah, huh. could have just sent Darmanitan in from the start. Hatsarine. Oh, you gotta make sure you're in a good mood. If anyone in the gym is, like, sad, it will freaking murder you. It does not like negative emotions. Okay, who do I send in? I'm keeping Cheeseburger in. Tsk. What's with that calm expression? Think you're going to win? He just looks so humbled. He doesn't look like a smug prick anymore. He's just like, he's like, yeah, man, I'm just glad that I get to, to battle. Oh! That's right, you have a Gigantamax form, and... I, f I forgot to initiate Dynamax, so so I guess Cheeseburger is screwed. Yep. This 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 eldritch creature from the I don't like sad people realm is going to kill me. That did a lot more damage than I anticipated. Max Flare. Yep. Well, Cheeseburger, you just got overcooked. I'm sorry. Well, push has come to shove. I'm ascending the dimp. And this Hatterene is going to get super dimmed. No. It's going to get Dyna dimmed. I just hope I look cool to my friends. Please don't be faster. Uh, Joy-Cons, please don't die on me during this very pivotal moment. Because this seems like really pivotal. More than pivotal. I learned this move from that old Gran. I plan on making it my own. Max Smite. Power of the stars. Uh, Floofbeck? You, uh... You wanna jump in on this? You wanna, you wanna, you wanna kill the, uh... The, the cosmic horror story in front of you? I mean, Floofbeck is... Fucked. He is fucked. And everyone else on my team... Soon after. Well, I'm not gonna be that fucked. Just gotta keep spamming double edge and everything will be okay. I just had to do it the one time. Okay. I'll take that as a victory. Shit, he is so humbled. I couldn't win, but at least I was able to show everyone how great fairy types are. Yeah, fairy types are pretty great. We can reduce dragons to being practical jokes. Well, I lost. It looks like Challenger Bade was no match for Challenger Matthew and his trusted team of badasses. 
Hey, Bade, that was some match. You still got disqualified, though. Don't retire, just restart your career. But this wasn't what I planned. If I was able to defeat you, then everything would be fine. Even if I lost, I was going to use retiring as an excuse to get away from that old lady. I just, I just want to make sure that I still have my other kidney. She is a dangerous old hag. With everyone cheering me on like this, I have no choice but to continue my training as the fairy-type gym leader. Though I suppose with my talents, I'll be able to overtake Miss Opal in no time. Stadium is filled with voices cheering on these young trainers. Now, Chandra Matthew, go, go, go to sleep. That was a satisfying fight. That was, that was, Bade, Bade's got a good character arc. It's a really great character arc. I'm gonna sit down, I'm gonna reflect about how Bade has become a better person. I miss the days when he was a smug prick. Was he always a smug prick? Has it always been so? Well, I'll have to think about it later. Because the day of fate has finally come. The day in which I destroy Leon. I'm coming for you. Oh, Leon. Leon. Come out and play. Can, can anyone hear my finger flaps? I'm trying, I'm trying to mimic that thing that they did in that movie. Bring forth the coward. The time for waiting is over. The finals of the Champion Cup are about to begin. The two trainers to face each other in the first battle of the first round are... Trainer endorsed by the champion himself. His opponent is the raging... What? Wait a second. But where's Leon? I can tell you you're growing far strong. Do I have to re-battle all the gym leaders? Is that it? What? Leon is delaying the inevitable. And very well. I guess, I guess we're, uh... I guess we're doing this again. Starting off with Golia's pod. So is this the Elite Four? Sonya may be disappointed, but I'm going to wash your team away. Um, yeah, um, it's not going to happen. Oh, that's a great first impression. That's a, that's also a great first impression. You fucking dodged my attack. I hate you. I hate your Golia's pod. I just want to fight Leon. Well, it looks like, uh, things are finally getting interesting. Finally! Took them long enough. The challenges are actually gonna be challenging now. You get a first impression me? Nope, you're just gonna liquidate me. I am so wet. Alright, let's let's play let's play rough because the dimster is horny! Yeah, anyone would make an emergency exit if uh so uh yeah, I see you uh you decided to keep your goldeen. It will be my dinner. It will not be my dinner. So do I just have to like battle all of the trainers again or do I have to battle half of them? What's what's up? What's up with that? I summon the warrior princess of some place to uh just just kill the fish with leaves. Thank you. Pelipper. Next Pokémon on our team is Pelipper. What would be good against the Peliper? Burgers. You feed the Pelipper burger and then it dies. Great, now it's raining on the crowd. Uh, I, I just hope they brought an umbrella. Because I don't want any any uh, any of our audience members getting sick. Yeah, just use Roost. You're only delaying the inevitable. But I'm sure you just gave half the audience a common cold. <laughs> okay, now that's lucky. Okay, let's just use Icicle Crash. I can only use Ice Punch. That was never agreed upon. I, I did not agree to those terms. Okay, just keep keep punching it. Wait, is that part of its ability? I have to look at its description because I don't think I ever looked at the uh, the description of its ability. Back to Gulio's pod. Just a moment, please. Gorilla tactics. Boost the Pokemon's attack stats, but only allows the use of the first selected move. Okay, so that explains quite a lot. Gets Gulio's podded. I'm just gonna use a Leaf Blade, because I don't exactly know what else to do. Uh, don't get knocked out by this, please. Are you gonna use, uh, Full Restore? Oh, you're not. Okay. RNG gods for the win, I guess. The rain stopped. People still got a cold. Beresciuta. 
Berascuda. You will be cut up by Zeno's leaves. I'm gonna do... with what that guy at that Korean restaurant did to the pufferfish with a carrot. Well, it looks like I won't be doing that, folks! Disaster has struck. My two strongest Pokémon have been defeated. Still have, like, a few more. Um, Zen Headbutt. Great. Defense fell. Would it be an opportune time to use Reversal? I'd like to think it's an opportune time to use Reversal. Assuming Floofbeck doesn't get fainted. Oh, and he committed the big faint. The big humiliation. Not very effective. That's fine. Oh, what's this? Strategy. Time to revive... Zeno, and now it's time to struggle against a, a fish. The day has finally come when I am being cornered by a fish. Never thought it'd be possible, but here we are today. Can you stop, like, spamming liquidation? You're like with B and revenge. Um, Ice Punch? I'm, I'm using Cheeseburger as the honorary sacrifice, so it's okay. Okay, Zeno, I need you to be a trooper. I need you to not get one-shotted by this Barascuda. Oh, I actually pronounced it right. Thanks, Zeno. Dreadnaw. Here we go. Looks like I'm down to one last Pokemon. You've been saving the best for last. You said this last time. Here we fucking go. You're gonna Gigantamax on me, aren't you? Well, looks like... You've made a big mistake. Going up against Zeno. Flood the stadium and make it our ocean. But th there's more people in this stadium. This is like the gym battle theme, but better. If only I finished this Let's Play sooner, I could have listened to a banger of a song much sooner. But here we are today. Fear of the mushrooms. Well, taking this Pokemon down was a... Uh pretty heckin' easy. I win. Yeah, no problem handling our surging might. It's no wonder that you won. Yeah. And the winner is Matthew. He defeated Nessa again. Hurrah. So, um... We gonna fight Leon yet? Because I'm just gonna keep complaining until we eventually do. Okay, it seems like, uh... Oh, I'm fighting Pierre's again. No, fuck. I'm fighting B again. Time to be spammed relentlessly with more revenge. And have a secret desire for her to be assumed today. I will never get over it. It's risky, but I could put Dimster in the front. And then I do that last time. I don't remember. Do I have any, like, moves that could, like, kick fighting-type ass? I mean, is this against the rules? Because I don't- Oh, I can teach you revenge. Ooh, I could teach you revenge, but no, that's that's not gonna help me against the fight against B. Could be some personal satisfaction, but that's really not gonna help me in this. Okay, where are the proficient moves? I don't feel like being proficient. I just want to kill Leon. I want to kill his career. Actually, I, I have no intention of murdering him. You know, do you ever just do you ever just think about? You ever just think about it, though? Just... If you're just tuning in, ladies and gentlemen, we witnessed quite the surprise during the finals here at this year's Champion Cup as the former gym challenger Bade stormed the stage, but Matthew was having none of that shit. This year's top challenger made quick work of him before washing away gym leader Nessa. On the other side, we have uh, the Galar Karate Prodigy. Let's hear it for Gym Leader B, everybody. Looks like a Sundare, but is actually really fucking calm. I promise you, my attacks will shake you, They're your very soul this time. Okay, maybe she's not that calm. Maybe a little eccentric, but not a Sundare. Everyone in Galar is really upset by this tragedy. All right, Halucha. All right, Halucha. You wanna play? That's that's not what I meant by playing. This is what I meant. Oh yeah, you like it rough, don't you, Lucha? Dirty bitch. Phalanx. Wait, that's the, uh... What is Phalanx again? I just realized that a good, like, fucking hell, like a... Fourth sixes of my team are weak to fighting-type moves. 
This is a problem, and, and now I'm actually kind of worried. She is going to destroy me again. Oh, right, Phalanx was the badass group. You got the badass Pokemon. Why do I always keep forgetting the names? Let's just do a breaking swipe. Whoosh! That did nothing. This is probably going to do more damage. Actually, it did less damage. But his speed fell. Alright, let's just do a snipe shot. Wow. That looked a little too well. Snipe all the Pokemon in my wake before they can spam revenge on me. I see you've learned your lesson. You've honed your skills and actually used a move that could be a serious detriment on my part. Good job! Graplocked. The tentacle mum. I've decided to go to war with the tentacles, and the war has begun. I'm most likely on the losing side. Unless if uh, we get a little rough. Come on, get knocked down, get knocked down. Yes! Falling down like dominoes. Machamp. Okay, this is it. This is the battle that is going to get me screwed over. I have an idea. We're going to do something akin to the waiting game. Except not really. It's time to dig in our heels. I'm not giving up. Neither should you. Thank you. Again, that's the exact same thing you told me last time. Yada, yada, yada. Um... Okay, Floofbeck. Brace for impact. Keep your arms. You don't have arms. Keep, keep all of your legs inside the vehicle at all times. The trip to heaven is gonna be pretty great. You did good, Bech. You did, you did, Godspeed. <gasps> the floof survived. We will emerge victorious. This is a sign from God. Uh, Zen headbutt the, 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 the giant building Pokemon. Steraladon. Not Machamp. Okay, this is ballsy, but I'm sending in Grimmsnarl. And then I'm just gonna use the power of the stars. Trust me, the power of the stars works. Have you seen a Disney movie? All you have to do is believe in yourself and wish to the stars. You'll, you'll just become a big, giant, like, green creature. And you can manipulate the stars. This is my wish. It's about to come true. You're gonna go down. I won. Your strength nearly made me want to turn and run in my bare feet. Wait. I fucking scared B? How could this be? No pun intended. Okay, it may have been intended when I started talking. Thank you for a wonderful match. You're welcome. I really enjoyed battling you and your team. I'm upset that I lost, but also I feel so satisfied and refreshed. Yeah, I have pretty smiley face. The next match will begin in no time, so stay in, those, in that seat. Alright, who am I fighting next? Of course. Who else but Raihan? Sis, you shouldn't be forcing your way in here. Yo. Sorry, Matthew. I thought my bro could get revenge for me, but he lost to Rayhan. You suck. You look so sloppy out there because people are going to think we're both weak because we're related. Guilt by blood! You got it wrong since Rayhan's just that strong, but I was able to show everyone in the audience how amazing a proper battle without using Dynamax can be. Alright, I get it, but that's exactly why I wanted you to win. I still thought it was a brilliant battle, though. I'm counting on you to win, Matt. You got that, I'll be cheering for you. Sorry to come in here for a chin wag just before the final match. Rayhan's waiting for you on the pitch. We're looking forward to a right good battle. My prediction is gonna send in uh, Flygon first. Cheeseburger. You you and your your big lips. You're gonna you're gonna give that flag on a good smooch. Give him a good old smooch. And when he's vulnerable, you stab him with this knife. I will do whatever it takes to fight Leon and to humiliate him and make him a shell of his former self. You hear me, cheeseburger? You will stab the flag on. I am untethered, and my race knows no bounds, and I have no more scruples! Can anyone understand the thing I'm saying? Because there's a part of me that is genuinely convinced that none of you are understanding the thing I'm saying. Okay, so, whatever you do, don't take a selfie. Leon's my rival, and he chose you, so I've got to first prove I'm better than you if I'm to beat him. I've reworked my whole team, and now we're all geared up for one-on-one -on -one battles. You might be thinking that you beat me once already. 
But if you think I'm the same Rayhan you faced during the gym challenge, you'll soon regret it. It's just going to be the same gym later except without double battles, and he's going to have an extra Pokemon. Well, that subverted my expectations. Why did I send a cheeseburger? Wow, Matt, you are you're so great. Good job in overlooking the factors. That's drought. It gets the sun like burning real harsh. He looks fucking crazed. Like he's out for my blood. Well, my, I'm out for Leon's blood, so... And, 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 my, and my rage outrages your rage. So, it is time for me to embrace my rage. See that lava plume? That's me on the inside right now. Just another snipe away from uh, sniping Leon's reputation. Oh, yeah, of course you know Solar Beam. It's one Solar Beam away from a bitter defeat. Oh, you survived! Thanks for living. Thanks for nothing. Get Tapubu. I just love the I just love the Torin ability. Gudra. He has Gudra. You have a gooey dragon. Gooey and filled with joy. I have the Dimster. He's dry and filled with dread. And you will become dry too. Just like Leon. Do you want to play a game? It's called Play Rough. Has Rayhan always looked that crazy? Whoop, 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 whoop. It's too bad you lost the game. There's no victories, only a series of bitter defeats. Unless you're Matthew McBacon, then it's only a series of victories. Superpower. Let's get rid of Belly Drum. I think Darmanitan could really use, like, a new move. Turtonator. You send in your turtle to do your job for you very well. It's gonna use the shell attack. So what am I gonna do? Um... Um, why did I use False Surrender? It's a Dragon type, and I have Fairy type moves. Now it's gonna, now it's gonna do the attack. I could have evaded all this tragedy if I just used Play Rough on him too. See, this is my fault. It's my fault being a stupid. But oh, ha! Well, um, I guess I just got lucky. Oh, he's doing it again. All right, just get knocked down and hit in a single hit, please. Oh, fuck! He did not. Sorry, Dimpy. You, you did good. Oh, he's fucking doing it a third time. Okay. Doesn't matter. Flygon. Okay, now we can go back to the original plan. Back to basics. Back to... To good old classic first degree murder. Stab the Flygon. Your sandstorms will do nothing with a knife in your back. Let winds blow. Stream forward, sandstorm. <laughs> it's my best impression of Rayhan. He, like, he's having a selfie withdraw. Here we go. We got the building Pokemon. There's so many possibilities to make edgy jokes, but I'm not that edgy. But it still changes nothing. The fact that I'm gonna take down your building. My partner sent everyone in the stadium flying. That sounds like a red flag, man. Just, 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 yo, know, just calm yourself down, all right? It is time to summon the fist. Uh, I wasn't quick enough. Ah, oh, your defense rose. That's so cute. Feel the wrath of fist. He has his own fist. Survive his fist. Now summon your fisty. Give him the fisty. <laughs> Is it weird for me to, to say that Duraludon's Gigantamax form kind of looks like Rose Tower? Losing in the finals is pretty rough, but I suppose I better take a quick shot to remember it by. Uh, don't don't take a selfie. The even Rotom is kind of sick of your shit. Rotom is the, he, he's just being used for selfie taken. You're not even like utilizing the bike or, or anything. Rotom is versatile, but you just blew right past us beyond anything I'd imagine. Still pretty young myself, but it just goes to show that there's always someone younger coming up, reaching further than you ever dreamed. We will bring the boomers to extinction. 
So yeah, uh, now I get to fight Leon. Ah, <sighs> finally! The day of reckoning. Alright, the big moment's finally here, eh? I just came to cheer you on, you know? Still, it's not easy picking sides. After all, it's the showdown being my big brother and my rival. Who should I really want to win more? You should vote for me. I will forgive you for your... Miserable existence. For being the kin of the champion. That I hate for like... I kind of forgot the reason why. <laughs> I don't know, was it because he was kind of a douchebag or... Was he really that douchey or was I... Just... I don't know. I mean, it, it, it's it's too late for me to turn back now. I mean, I can't have second guesses. But either way, I'm I'm happy. I'm I'm happy to be destroying him. Watch him have like level 100 Pokemon, and he just curb stomps me. I better save my game twice. I need to play things as safely as possible. Revenge for petty reasons. I'm gonna save my game a third time. I'm not insecure. There he is. There is the meat that will turn rotten. Oh, you're just smiling at me? Okay, now I'm more motivated to kick your ass. The tents still air on the pitch, and the exact opposite from the audience, cheering and yelling. They're both fantastic, wouldn't you say? But remember, the audience is also a bit cruel. They want nothing more than to see one of us lose, after all. If I can fill you with fear knowing that I... No, it can fill you with fear knowing that, but I absolutely love pushing past the fear. I love giving it everything I've got as a trainer, and seeing my team give everything they've got sees another victory. It's the greatest feeling in the world, and I can't get enough of it. You're about to know what it's like to lose. You're going to have a real champion time. You, you're going to have a bad time. A bad time. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hey, look at the monitor. What's on the big sur- What the hell? Hello there, Leon and Matthew Chairman Rules! I think it's time I brought about the darkest day for the sake of Galar's future, of course. What the fuck, man? But I'm in a bit of a pickle. The energy released by the darkest day was too much for us to contain, so, uh... Sorry, I kind of made a mistake. Uh, you know, you forced my hand, you refused to listen. Oh my god, he is that bad. So it's canon. Yeah, everyone in the audience, you'll be fine. Lee, Matthew, that video stream, that was from Hammerlock Stadium, right? What in the world did the chairman just do? I don't know. But everything he was saying yesterday, did he really pull this crazy stunt to solve some problem a thousand years in the future? I've gotta go see what's going on. I'm the champion, I have to go. Should have realized what the chairman intended to do before it came to this. I'll take responsibility now for fixing this mess. He actually is that evil. So yeah, um, I was bored. So I decided to start the apocalypse. <laughs> Hold the phone. The chairman was talking about the darkest day. That's the thing that where the sky went all dark once ages and ages ago, right? What does that mean? He's bringing that about and where did he, where did he even hear that name? Back in Motostoke, man. The statue of the hero in Motostoke. Sonya said something back then, didn't she? Though it turned out to be wrong since there was actually two heroes and all that. Still, those two managed to bring an end to the Darkest Day with the Sword and Shield Pokemon. Yeah, great. Information dump while the apocalypse is happening outside. There are people in the stadiums dying horribly. Why don't we just go to the slumbering Wealb? That seems like a pretty good idea. Let's go to the slumbering Weald. We can, we can, we can die there for, together romantically. We got here really fast, huh? Matthew and Hop. Oh, I completely forgot about the championship match. What are you two doing here? Oh, thank God, my mom is still alive. Oh, fucking Christ. Huh? Yeah, um, he kind of sent me death threats via text on the way here. Huh? What? What happened while I was researching things in the slumbering Weald? Well, for starters, there's a great black storm or something raging over Hamelock Stadium. What they're calling it, the darkest day, it throws everything into disarray. Still, I'm sure we don't need to worry too much. The unbeatable champion will be able to take care of everything, won't he? Yes, I will. Okay, I'm calling myself the champion of Galar from now on. 
But I'll never get over the fact that Sherman has robbed me of that! All my anger and hatred is now on him! I'm sorry, I need to stay calm. I'm gonna stop the darkest day. I'll catch up with you once I'm done looking into something that's been bothering me. Thanks for the three max revives. Certainly appreciate it. All that matters is that you do what you can. You've become a fine Pokemon trainer, so this Chairman Rose is just going to show up with a gun and just shoot my mom in the back of the head. That would be awful. Don't do that. Don't pull that dark twist on me, Nintendo. Wonder if we're about to head straight into the wall of fog again. Oh, let's fucking do it. Going into the forest after Wooloo that day, that was the start of everything, wasn't it? A legendary beginning, really. The day when... when... We witnessed something truly beautiful. I'm not talking about Zekian. Talking about Wooloo.